I'm back! <laughs> Sorry about the break, but we're back in Minecraft Hardcore. The reason I've been away, if you didn't follow me on Twitter or if you didn't get the notification for my community post on here, I was away because I was sick. My voice disappeared and it was just better for me to rest than force through it and stuff, but none of that matters now. I'm back. And welcome back to the Hardcore world where today I don't have shoes on my feet still. And that is because they're still almost broken and I'm only at level 19. Now, as you can see from my uh, my inventory here, I have been busy. I did a little bit of work on my hardcore world while I was away because I didn't need to talk to do it. And I've done this. Um... <laughs> You know what? It doesn't look like I've done much, but this has taken me forever. Like, literally forever. This took me four hours to do to undo, like, all of this. I've flattened all of this part out. You can see I've only got a too high wall protecting my, um, my turtles now, which means... Things aren't going to be able to get in unless they walk off of here. So way less places for zombies to jump off and kill my turtles, which is which is always going to be a plus. So I just need to get rid of this. Uh, but yeah, I've, I've taken out most of this. The only thing that I do think I need to do, which is annoying, is move this farm. Because this farm is on this level right here. And the rest is down here. And I want to make sure this castle is properly floating, even if we move it that way. So my sheep, my crops, they're all going to have to come down like 10 blocks, I think. So you guys are going to be on the move soon. I don't know if you can hear me of your barring, but that's going to happen, okay? Tell everyone else. Yep, go and tell the rest of the crew. <laughs> Today, though, we need to make some more progress on our sea temple because if you didn't see it last time, it was absolutely tragic. Roll the clip where I almost died, please. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, I've messed up here, guys. Oh, I found sponge. I found sponge. Oh, I'm in trouble. I'm in big trouble. What have I done? Oh, this could be the end. This could actually be the end. Here we go. I'm going. Come on. Oh, jeez. Oh. oh. Yeah. That was, um, I almost had a heart attack, which wasn't good. But I almost died because I didn't set things up properly. I should have got myself a conduit, which I had all the materials to make a conduit, but I just didn't do it. Give me unlimited water breathing, and I would have been fine. So today... We're going to make one of those. We need to get rid of all of this stuff. My goodness, look how much of this we've got. I had to make a double chest for dirt. That's how you know you've been mining for too long. Oh, actually, yeah, sponge. That's another thing. We need to go into the sponge room. I'm going to take this with me. I've got a lot of emeralds. What have I been doing? <laughs> I think I've been doing a lot of trading off camera, I'm pretty sure. Just because I wanted to get my emeralds back up, I do want to try and get to that level 33 before I go. But I don't know how I'm going to achieve it. Oh, you know what I did want to do? I need to... No! Oh my goodness, that hurts way more without my boots on. Wow. I need to get some fish and trade with my fishermen. I do use them to eat at the moment, but I have a lot of fish. I've got puffer fish, salmons, nemos. I do need eight nautilus shells as well, so let's grab one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We are apparently you can grind off books. I didn't think you could do that. I've only got three, but it might do a little bit of helping. Got us up to level 20. That's not so bad. And now we've just got some blank books. Beautiful. What I could have done, actually, is left my AFK fish form on for, like, a week. <laughs> the whole time that I've been away. I should have done that, really. All right, let's go and trade with this fisherman. Let's trade with my boy, the cartographer, as well, because I'm always trading with you, aren't I? That's where most of my emeralds have come from, to be honest. Where is my fishy boy? Where is he? Where is he? Is this you? It is. 15 raw fish makes an emerald. I didn't even pick up any. This is going well so far. I'm still trying to get used to being a YouTuber again. It's been a while, okay? Please forgive me. But while the sun is setting, how about we make this, uh, this conduit, shall we? So it's one heart of the sea and eight nautilus shells makes a conduit. But that's not the only thing that you need. It's not a cube. It's like the wireframe of a cube around it to be able to give it its max potential, which I think is like 90 blocks of radius. Let's have a quick look. What can I make? Yeah, I can make blocks. I think I've got enough blocks to do it. If not, I can go and grab them now because I got rid of all the Elder Guardians last time, which is great news because they suck. So I've got my conduit. Let's grab these blocks. I'm just going to grab all of these. All right, let's go trade some fish as well, shall we? Lots of things to do. Hello? 
Hello, fisherman. I would like to take as many of your wares as possible. That's a lot of fish. What's your next trade? Come on, I want to trade salmon and puffer fish with you. Salmon? Okay, that's good. He'll give me an unbreaking rod as well. He's just gone up another level. He's leveling up like crazy already. Six Nemos. Okay, that ain't actually too bad. He's giving me a lot of experience too. He's a master. But wait, four of these for an emerald? Ooh, that's so much. Oh my goodness. Jungle boat for one emerald? That means if I find a jungle, I literally need to make my own jungle and then I can trade five pieces of jungle wood for one emerald. That's ridiculously good. Okay, fisherman. I respect it. The main thing I really need is experience. I can't think of another way to get mending onto the Gucci slides without it costing 33 emeralds. It's just because the Gucci slides are so good. Oh, wait, I could grind off these. I could definitely grind off these. Right, I don't need any of these, do I? I'm pretty sure. What else can we grind off? This, I'm breaking and mending. I need to make sure I don't grind the shoot as well. That would be tragic. Cool, that should be everything. I need the sharpness book. I also need to buy a mending book as well. Let's grind all these off. Let's just make sure that they're the right ones, okay? Uh, I'm so nervous. Luck of the sea, don't need that. Feather falling, got that. Law, got that. This is one I don't need, got that. Normal bow, get out of here. Normal bow, get out of here. And I think that's everything. Okay, we grind up to level 26. That's not too bad at all. Oh man, I, I, I could buy enchanting bottles to get up to it, but I think it's gonna cost me like 10 emeralds per level. So it might just be a waste. Actually, let's uh let's get some more paper and stuff so we can finish off our cartographer trade. I don't think I'm running out of fish yet. I'm just needing to restock to be able to get the fish. I don't really wanna buy too many levels. Right, let me do this and I'll be back. Oh, and this guy I was trying to make into a villager that had a an efficiency trade. I managed to get up to efficiency four, but I want efficiency three because it's just cheaper to put together and does pretty much the same thing. But he kind of hates me right now because I was in a pattern of putting something down, breaking it over and over again. I, I hit him a few times by accident. Definitely by accident. I hit him and he doubled his prices. So I need to work on um, sweet talking him around a little bit because he doesn't like me that much. And to be honest, that's understandably so, right? I did smack him in the nose, but it wasn't intentional. Okay, I'm sorry, Mr. Villager. I'm sorry. But now I just need to, yeah, give me your emeralds, boy. I, I kind of want your experience more at this point. Oof, you have got lots. I've almost got two stacks of emeralds now. That ain't too bad. Look at him. He's so cute. I love it when they hold their emeralds. They're like, master. I will give you this. <laughs> That's what I imagine they say anyway. What else can I sell? I want to sell lots of things. Oh, I can sell scoots to this guy. That's kind of cool. Nether wart, three emeralds for one enchanting bottle. That's pretty steep. I'm going to grab all the fish that I've got and trade with this guy. Oh, another thing that I've added as well. I added a little door to this because it was getting a little bit crazy. We now have five iron golems and one of them has wandered off. So we did have six at one point. You have mending, which is 30 emeralds. I should probably do that with you. I think that'll give me a little bit of experience anyway. Pretty sure I don't have the mending book anywhere else. I'm sure I've used that. We've got the farmers we can trade with. Okay, this is going to take some work, but I think we can get there. And the reason I'm doing this is so I can swim faster underwater, which I did the whole temple last time, not doing. So let's go and buy the book, shall we? I've got, I've come back with the book I have returned. It is you. There you go. Thank you, buddy. I wish you gave me more experience for that, but it's fine. You only took half my emeralds. Crazy man. Fisherman Joe. Okay, I haven't got enough of those. I haven't got enough of those. I got two Nemos. 27. We're so close. Right, it's farmer time. Let's do this. And let me just triple check how much this costs. 33. Oh, that's going to be so good, though. It better not, they better not die before they actually get mended. 26 more levels. That's crazy. Here we go. Extreme farming. <laughs> that sound is so satisfying. Oh, my goodness. This is great. Yo, look how many carrots and stuff I've got. Let's go. I can make so many golden carrots. Yes. So let's trade all these, and hopefully we get close to level 33 so I can just buy the rest because I'm going to have so much money. We can trade with Witch. We can trade with the other farmer. I'm pretty sure oh. the farmer's still around. I don't even know where they've gone. Oh, I need to fix this too. It's kind of underwater, so it doesn't matter too much. But hey, I'm not going to touch you. I'm not going to touch you or even talk to you. You know what? I just want to trade this stuff with you. Wow. Okay, that was quick. Take all my potatoes. Melons. Wow, you run out really, really quickly. Fine. 
I was expecting to get to level 33, but you know what? I'm gonna go to my non-witchy friend instead. I think they might be in here, actually. Yeah, they're right at the end. Look, check this out. <laughs> okay, you didn't really take many of my things, did you? Oh, the other one didn't have the carrot trade. Look how many carrots. Carrots are definitely the best. Dude, everyone's coming to get my carrots. I don't think so. You know, get melons. Okay, sweet. You are you are leveling up like crazy. He sells suspicious stew now as well, which is kind of cool. I think that's everything. I'm up to level 29. How many emeralds do I have? Almost a perfect stack. I'm gonna buy some. I don't know how many of these I'm gonna buy though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's a lot. I get experience for buying them too. Oh my goodness. That does not get me many at all. I only need three more levels, dude. I don't want to spend all the emeralds I've just got because I'm doing pretty well on them at the moment. Oh, jeez. Jungle boats. I don't think I found a jungle biome yet, have I? Pretty sure there's no jungle biome on here. That's probably why he's paying so much for them. This guy will take white wool. You know what? Take it. Take it. Gray dye. I've forgotten how you, how you even make gray dye. Clay and stone. I could make a lot of stone, actually. There you go. Stone in the furnace. Do I have any smooth stone at all? I must have some. I got 33, so he wanted 20 of that, right? I'm pretty sure. What else? What else? What else can I sell? Can I? I'll sell a cat. This one. This one right here. You can have it. 10 emeralds. <laughs> Hold on a second. Where is evil cat gone? Uh, okay. Evil cat has genuinely disappeared. Where did... I, I told them to look out for evil. I'm pretty sure. Or are you evil, cat? I'm, I'm so confused. I can't even remember which one I'm accusing of being evil. I'm, I've got my eyes on both of you, okay? Just in case. So confused. Oh, I found a better way to get experience. It's all about the quartz. I'm on 32. Why didn't I think of this before? I did not realize quartz gave you so much. I'm already almost at 33 already. Right, more quartz. More quartz. Let's go. Yes, 33. And I've got a ridiculous amount of quartz. Let's go. Okay, so now we can combine those. That is such a good way to get experience. I need to remember that because the nether is obviously infinite, just like the overworld. So we need to do that in the future to get experience. That's that's awesome. Let's put these back in here. Look at these beauties. Like two stacks of emerald. That's so good. Now, before it gets to nighttime, let's mend these boots. Bop and bop, Gucci slides are now going to be pretty much perfect. I did not- Now, there we go. I was going to say, I didn't get the sound. What's that about? I'm now empty on levels, but now I'm ready to go. I'm pretty sure. I can now depth stride on my way through the Guardian's Temple and try and find the gold. Because I'm pretty sure there's gold in there somewhere. I just need to find it. So what else do I need? I need this. I need to repair this. It costs 17. Can I put mend? You can't put mending on a boat either, can you? Oh, that's that's unfortunate. I'm gonna have to go and get myself some uh, some experience then, aren't I? So now I can grab my conduit stuff, which is what I was gonna do in the first place. Let's grab all this. The conduit. I don't need this. You, you it didn't work last time. Outrageous. Sponge. I need. Let's get out of here. Let's go. It's conduit time. And I think we should be able to use this. If it is all planned and correct, I should be able to just reuse my pathway. Um, where was it though? Was it this one? Pretty sure it was this one. Right, I'll see you in like 10 minutes. <laughs> Whoa! I made it, but something's trying to kill me. Why is there a blaze spawner outside? Quick, 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 quick! Oh, that would have been tragic. It would have been too bad actually, because I could just uh, dive in the water. Right, let's build ourselves a conduit, shall we? I'm pretty sure the way we do it, it's kind of a cube. Let's grab some of this just so we can kind of mock it up. But I want to put it directly underneath. I'm pretty sure. That's going to be tricky though, isn't it? Because I'm going to have sea guardians everywhere. They're going to annoy me. It's going to be great. It's going to be fantastic, actually. <laughs> I also don't want these to break before I can collect experience and have them mend. So I might just try and slay some of these guys first. Oh, there's so many of them. So many. Okay, yeah, this is bad. This is bad. Stop. Stop this at once. Please don't kill my Gucci slides. What am I supposed to do? What if I put it on top? If I put it on top, so like literally up there, is that going to work? I'm kind of asking as if you guys should uh, be able to answer me like instantly, but obviously that's not the case. Oh, I remember where I hate this so much. They're going to die. They're literally going to die. I feel like I need to mend them a bit first, but I don't have what I need to do that out here. Oh, the nether. 
Why don't you use the nether? I can use some quartz to heal it up. That's the stuff. Because if you didn't know, mending needs XP and then your armor kind of like absorbs it. Oh, I need to be careful here though. Yep, yep, yep. Let's go. Let's go. Let's just find as much quartz as we can and get out of here. That sounds way too tragic to do it there. This is better. Good. Okay, let's do this. I just want to heal it a little bit. I might take off everything else actually because everything else is uh, not needed. There we go. Yeah, look at that. It's already like, it's already up loads. Give me the sweet, sweet XP. Look at that. I'm already up to level four, level five, just from quartz. That's crazy. Okay, is that going to be enough? Seven levels. That's pretty much back up to half. With diamonds, that should be way more than enough, right? Let's go and destroy this temple. <gasps> Baby zombie. Baby zombie, why aren't you riding a chicken, sir? If you were riding a chicken, I'd be taking you home. But for now, you've got to stay in this crazy place. No blazes. That's good. Okay. All right. Let's do this now, shall we? Let's reset this to get rid of the glitch. Now, conduit. And I need all of my building materials ready to go. So now I should be able to swim at full pelt. Yeah, I'm just going to put it on top. You know what? I'm just going to do it. Oh, man. This is so much better. Look how fast I can aggress on them, too, when they're pushing me back. Dude, this is so much better. As long as I'm not drowning, this is better. <laughs> so the frame has to be five by... Who is attacking me? Who is that? All the way down from there? Really? Good range. I respect it. So the frame needs to be five high. Get out of here. I'm trying to do some building. That's what Minecraft's about, you punk. It needs to be five by five. So one... I think the conduit can go here. That's prismarine bricks. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Dude, how did I almost die to that? No, get away from me. Come on. I want to put the conduit dead center. So I should be able to do this. Come on. There we go. Conduit placed. That's good. But I don't think it's active yet. Please stop. I should have bought golden apples with me again. Did I not learn my lesson from last time? Totem. Golden apple. All that stuff. Oh, so stupid. I didn't even bring a bed with me. Oh my goodness. I'm tragic. Absolutely tragic. Come on. Regen. Regen. Get those extra one and a half hearts. Please. I need them. Desperately. There we go. Right. I'm going back in. I'm just going to build the frame. Even if I'm taking a batter in, I'm just going to do it. Then we need to go up like this. I need the conduit to actually activate. That's not working. There we go. Okay. 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 This is going to work though. There needs to be like uh, a three. I see three by three block of space around the conduit i'm pretty sure but as long as it's made out of the right materials it should be fine everyone's coming up for battle look at them <laughs> they're ready to kill me almost like la actually i almost killed myself last time but um they wanted that to happen again oh the punch sounds are so satisfying i actually need to get rid of this door i'm pretty sure this door has to go really door why are you taking so long to get oh my goodness sea guardians are actually the worst hey dolphin can you help me out please I'm struggling. There we go. Look at the speed! <laughs> there we go. I did it. Right, now I need to place things here. Get out the way, please, guys. You're interrupting my building. Oh, wait. The conduit's active. The conduit just activated, right? It's on my top right. Conduit power, 12. So the way it, um, the way it works is the more of the frame that you build, the more active the conduit becomes. So I should be able to tank their damage a little bit better because I don't need to... I'm not going to be taking breathing damage. But there's so many spawning. It's crazy. I don't know if this is like a hardcore thing. Looks like I get underwater vision as well, which is pretty nice. It'd be so good if I can just make this whole top section void of water so I could build it up. I could use netherrack. That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure it has to be some form of prismarine block to work, by the way, for the, for the frame. But hopefully you can see what kind of pattern I'm trying to make. I'm using kind of the top of it. Yes, this is it. Yeah, look at that thing. That's actually amazing. Look at that. It's getting like experience from it. Dude, that's crazy. Get out of here. You're ruining this moment for me. I haven't finished the frame yet. I need to add... Do I need to add this? I'm getting close. There we go. That might be it. Yes, it is. It is. Look, it's gone red. Now I can stay under here forever. I've done it. I am now a champion. I did bring my sponge with me. That is good. Can I put the sponge... Oh, no. Okay, did not mean to do that. I should not have done that. That was a bad idea. I've broken it already. Let's put the water back. Let me do that. Oh, no. Trust me to break it. 
Ah, there we go. It's fixed. Okay, do not put sponge underneath or within the conduit. It needs that to focus. I think this does damage to sea guardians as well. I think that's why they're leaving us alone. Yeah, it is. It's doing damage. It just died. And that wasn't me. So I want to show you the frame that I want to make. Just in case you guys want to make it at home. It's kind of like a cube, but kind of not, I guess. See, it's got the red in the middle, so it still means that it's working. Let's get rid of all of these outer bits. Look at this. This is so much better. I needed this before so badly. Now, I'm pretty sure the range on this should be 90 blocks. So I should be able to go the whole way into the sea temple without needing any kind of uh, refresh of breath or anything. Yes, conduit. The conduit. Look, the little particles attack it. That's so cool. You're going to get smacked, boy. Look at the particles coming after it. Oh, my goodness. Look, it gives it like a virus. That's so cool. Look at that. I didn't even do any damage to it. That's so cool. It's even getting this guy. I don't have to do anything now. Look at that. It's going to get thorns from hitting me. And the conduit is also going to smack it. That's really cool. So this is the shape. So this right here is the shape that you need to make. It's kind of like a cube, but also kind of not begun. I've taken over this place now. This is part of my all-powerful plan. <laughs> But yeah, this is what you need to make. You need to make it all out of prismarine, some things, just all kind of blocks that has prismarine in the name, and you should be successful. I don't know how far the attacking part of the conduit goes down, but the breathing should be able to get us all the way into the center of this to be able to claim our treasure that we couldn't claim last time. I didn't even notice I was almost on half hearts there. Should I start taking this apart or should I start draining it? I think I'm going to take it apart, you know. Why not? Let's just dig out a big hole in the top and then we can see what on earth is going on here. So there you go. That is pretty much the top caved out. Didn't take me too long at all. Looks like I haven't put this dead center, but that doesn't matter. Looks kind of cool though. So it means that we do have a way to get out. I don't know if this conduit is going to reach all the way down, but let's find out because there are some like weird pockets where these guys are getting stuck. What is this? Oh, geez. Let's get out. Let's get out. Okay, let's not risk our life again. That would be tragic. <laughs> but the rest seem to have just kind of gone apart from a few of them, which I am not complaining about. <laughs> Look at this slow motion arrow. I love that. Okay, yeah, there's a lot stuck in here. I think that's from where I've done all this sponge already. I have got some more sponge that I can use. Let's just try it. There we go. <laughs> That's what that noise is. It's them flopping around. I thought it was the, uh, I thought it was the dolphins for some reason. Where are you going, buddy? Don't run away from me. This is my house now, boy. Oh my goodness, I wonder what that was. I was like, why are there arrows popping off? I feel like I should be able to get this to go apart from the middle. Yeah, that's what I was looking forward to doing. So now if I chop these out, this is perfect. That's the front door. Dude, this is working so well. So let's test and see if we can get to the... What is all this gravel? Oh, that's the bomb. <laughs> Okay, uh, we have gone right through the middle. I need to find the sponge room so we can work on trying to get most of this water out. Apart from this middle column, I feel like that'd be quite cool. But we can walk around this just to our heart's content and try and find the treasure, which I still haven't found yet. You guys okay in here? Just hanging out? You stuck? How long have you been stuck there for, huh? A week? Dang. You're not gonna be here anymore. Don't worry. That's not gonna be a problem. See you later. <laughs> Why didn't I use the conduit before? That's so stupid. I definitely should have used one before. Since I'm not going to lose any health by drowning, this is just so much easier. Look at this. There's so many of them, but it's fine. They can get affected by thorns. My bow is just ridiculous. Mending is in action as well. You know what? Depth Strider is the main thing, actually, that I'm able to use. Ooh, this might be it. This might be the room I'm looking for. Is there anything in here? Nope, nothing in here. Okay, good to know. There might be something around the corner, though. So I think that's where I almost died. Pretty sure. Let's go around. Yeah, this way. This is where I was going through. This is close to where I was before. I was in here at some point because I put dirt down. It was around one of these corners where I should be able to find the little corridor that I made to try and get out. It might even be here. Is it? It is. This is where I went in. And this is the this is the sponge that I wanted to grab. Dude, I could have been... <laughs> and it could have been so much easier to get out. But it was fine. We didn't die. We're okay. I just need to collect all these. Dry them out because there is a lot of sponge here. And that should be able to help me to try and find the gold blocks. Because the treasure is actually really hard to find. Like, why? It's not even a good treasure. It's gold blocks. I mean, in hardcore, it might be considered a good block. But still... Give me diamonds. I need diamonds from this. Are you kidding me? 
Okay, almost done. I've got three to go. There was a lot of sponge in here, like way more than I thought there would be. Let's see how much I've collected. It's all floated to the surface. Give me, give me all that sponge. 34, that's actually great right here, wet sponge. So I need to dry that out to be able to dry out the actual temple and try and find this gold because it's eluding me. How have I not found this? Is it in this room? I feel like it's not because this is where we just came from, right? Let's go and dry out the uh, the sponge and try and make it so that everything is dry so we can find this. If there is no gold, we would have risked our life for absolutely nothing. I need, I might need some more, uh, more wood for this. Oh, there is a bed down here. Yes, I knew there was one somewhere. <laughs> there we go. There's actually way less guardians spawning because of the conduit, I'm pretty sure. I had no idea that the conduit actually damaged the guardians. I didn't think that happened at all. So that's that's a cool little thing to note. If you're having trouble with the guardians, make sure you bring your conduit with you. Because last time I didn't, and I technically died, but I had the... the the totem, so I was fine. Look, they get attacked by it now. You can see them just glowing red every now and then. Look. <laughs> you idiots! Actually, keep on doing it. It saves me some trouble. And these boots, almost up to full. They would have cost me so much in diamonds to repair. 33 levels per diamond, I think, as well, which is crazy to think about. And actually, while I'm here, I'm gonna plop down a chest just to keep all my goodies because I'm bound to get some more. Look, all this prismarine. The lanterns I really want to use. Uh, why have I got leaves? That's random. I've got a lot of goodies to take back, and it's not that far to take back either. This is great. I think we're lucky to find a sponge room as well, actually. I don't think that's that common. Hmm, I just had a thought. What if I make it so that I can put in some fence gates at the top to stop the water coming in, and then drain it? I don't know how many I'd need, though. I need quite a lot, because otherwise, it's just going to keep on coming in. So if I do sponge in here... Actually, what if I do this? Yeah, this should work, right? Is that going to get rid of all of it? I mean, kind of. That might just work. Yes. Just have a column going down the middle. There we go. That's why I want to eventually have it like. Front door here and rest just down. Okay, that's not going to work. And we can just redry this out whenever we want, which is even better. There you go. What are you doing over here? Is that because the conduit is scaring you? They're coming out of their natural habitat? I get it. You know what? I get it. The conduit even works all the way out here, which is great. Look at that thing. A thing of natural beauty. Unlike you. All right, so let's try and get rid of some of this, shall we? Look at that. Amazing. How are we going to tackle this bit, though? Like that? And then just have the middle come in? That should work fine, right? Dirt here. Should get rid of these bits. And then we just got a column of water going down the middle. Just for transport, which is fine. I feel like I should be able to do that here, too. Where else is it running from? Here? Okay, it runs all the way from in here, too. Ah, oh, this is a full room. How do I get rid of a full room's worth? It's going to need a lot of sponge to work, but let's get rid of a whole room's worth of water. You know what? I think it works. Ah, uh, I know what I need to do. I need to brick this out like this. I need it to go down there. Minecraft water physics. Ah, oh, it's perfect. It's beautiful. It works. Release the sponge. It has done its duty, but I still haven't found the treasure. What is that about? Ah, uh, the shovel is going to break. That's not good. And also, can mobs now spawn in here like normal ones? I'm pretty sure they can. It's just a normal dark room now. There we go. That's one section completely drained. Look at this. <laughs> now show me where the treasure's at. This is the bottom floor, so I might actually cover this bit up. So we know that's the bottom floor, and we can't go any further. Oh, wait, this might be it. This might be it. This might be the treasure room. I don't know how I found it, but I did. I'm going in. Yes, okay, I found it. Sweet. I do want the lanterns, because I think they're going to look cool replacing our glowstone at home. Looks like we got four blocks. A whole four blocks of treasure. Is that is that worth it? I'm not sure, but that's what we got, regardless of whether we wanted it or not. Actually, did I say four blocks? I mean eight blocks. Your boy can't count. Let's take all of it. Give me all this shininess. Let's count it properly. How many did we get? Seven. There's one missing. Where's the- there it is, the missing block. We got eight blocks, so whatever eight times nine is. 72, maybe? I haven't done math in a very long time correctly, so I doubt my own skills. It's gonna take a lot to drain, though. I don't think- oh, there's another sponge room. Dude, that's good. That would help the cause. I don't remember coming in here. Is that weird? Did I come in here at all? I don't think I did. I think I stayed in this opening here and then fought the Elder Guardian. I'm pretty sure that's what happened here. I think these might be quite rare as well, so I might take these with me too. Even though I use them for some of the conduit, I'm pretty sure they're only in the middle parts, like around here. We finally found the treasure. 
We did 72. You know what? That is actually, that's not too bad. That could be way worse, actually. So as long as my math is correct, which, uh, as I said, might not be the case. Got some sea lanterns out of it. Loads of prismarine too, which is a cool little block. And it's the only place you can get it. Right, I'm going to grab the rest of the sponge and see if we can dry out the rest of this. Because I think it can be done. Last piece, then we can find out how much we got. And I have another idea, but I want to test out something. I need to grab a dolphin by the lead, because look at the speed. If we can trap a dolphin in here, we'll always have that speed. We have 39 sponges. Um, where is... There we go. I want to see if I can capture one. <laughs> Listen to that. When they get stuck outside, they sound ridiculous. <laughs> you sound crazy. I would just keep one of you alive just for that to happen. Right, where is there a dolphin? I'm sure I saw one. There it is. Right, can you come here? Can I actually grab you? Come here. I can't grab it. Oh, I got it. I actually have it. No way. You can actually grab the dolphins. Why can't you grab the turtles, huh? Oh, no. Is it going to die? Please don't die. Don't come on land, please. Just stay there. You are now my pet and kind of my prisoner. There we go. There's one fence gate. So I'm going to put one of these. Are you coming with me? Come on, buddy. Look at this. <laughs> I'm so fast, boys. Oh, my goodness. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is actually nuts. I didn't realize you could do this. Come on, dolphin boy. I've always wanted to capture one of you. It's nothing personal. There we go. <laughs> so now I should have, like, super speed as soon as I come in here, right? It's working. If I capture loads of dolphins, I can go so fast. Put them all the way around this place. And I've got a super speedy ocean monument in here. I do feel a little bit bad, though. Look at it. It's like, please, please let me leave. Please kill me. I'm sorry. I can't let that happen. Any more dolphins around? I might need to capture some. There's one right there. Let's go. I think he knows what's going on here. So he's disappeared. He's bounced. I saw you. I definitely saw one. Hey, your friend got away from me this time, but you're going to stay here. <laughs> It's crying. I actually feel really bad, but it's helping me in my mission and it, it makes nice noises too. Wait, is there something here too? I'm gonna have to kill all these punks. No, nope, no gold in here. Just an empty pillar. Just like my dreams. Empty. There you go. I've cleared out most of the guardians from here though. Getting some fish out of it. This bit desperately needs clearing out though. It's crazy. I have some sponge. I might just do it. There we go. How do you feel about that? I'm gonna put some here too. I want to hear you flop. There we go. I heard you flop at least once. Uh-oh. What just died? Oh, no. Did my dolphin just die? I heard dolphin death sounds. Dolphin! Dolphin, please. No, how did the dolphin die? Who did that? To you? How dare you? He was my friend for like two minutes. And you lost me my lead. I think this is atrocious behavior. No. Where did it go? More importantly, where's my lead? <laughs> Those things are expensive. I'm gravely upset. Okay, that's not gonna work. Is that the fish from it? Oh, no. No wonder the other dolphin ran away from me. Jeez, he knew that was gonna happen. But how did it die? Did the sea guardians attack dolphins? Is that what happens? Oh, they attack squids, don't they? I didn't think this through. Let's try and get some more of this. Water cancelled out. I know I can do a whole room. It just takes a whole lot of sponge. I can hear guardians literally flopping around. I'm not quite sure what's happened here. <laughs> it's the weirdest noise. You good, bro? <laughs> oh, man, it's funny. It's too funny. Right, this needs to go. Let's keep it going, boys. This is not too bad of a room, I don't think. There we go. That's done. Sweet. Easy mode. Oh, you're not going to attack me now, are you? You're just stuck in here. Listen. Oh, it's great. It sounds like panic and struggle, exactly like when I was here. You little dope, come here. <laughs> Get out of here. Oh, they make a little crying sound. That's weird. I didn't like that. That's another section taken out. That was pretty easy. And as well, there is a way to, to make a Sea Guardian spawner, but you do have to drain. You have to drain a lot to be able to do it. I'm going to grab all this too. I want these Sea Lanterns. I want as many of them as I can use at home. What's through here? Oh, this is that main room. This is going to take so long to make decent, right? I don't even know where you'd start with this. <laughs> okay, it actually takes out quite a lot if you place it in the right section. I'm going to find out how much sponges actually take out. Oh, it's seven in all directions. Oh, I need to be using this way more effectively. So like here. Oh, no, wait, that's not working either. Why is that? You just need to find the source blocks and use it, and then it will drain out. It's ironic, because after we do this, the conduit's going to be pretty useless, to be honest. 
Whoa, where did you guys come from? Chill. To make me drain this, because I will. It's definitely going to take me a while because I'm not quite sure how this is working or not working. <laughs> I think you just have to put it on the source blocks and then the rest will drain pretty frequently. The only thing is I should probably bring my furnace and some coal down here to be able to do the whole thing. But in that same breath, why would I need to? Because I've got the conduit, so why would you? I think I might actually be done with this area, you know. I've got the treasure. I got some sea lanterns. I've drained a lot of it, but there's not really much I want to use it for right now. I need your guys' help of how I should use these rooms. They're pretty cool rooms. It's a massive temple. And if I take the time to drain all of it, it'll be worth it for something. But I'm just not sure what right now. But hey, there you go. That's how you drain a temple. If you just continue doing that over and over again, you'll get it. That's how you make a conduit as well. That before today, I didn't know actually damages guardians. And we already lost one of our friends. <laughs> The poor dolphin. I didn't know he got killed by sea guardians, okay? There you go. Sea temple conquered. I should have done the conduit from the beginning, but you know what? It was actually quite a, a task trying to put the conduit in. Next mission. What is our next mission? The first one is getting all this stuff back. I don't know how I'm going to do that because that is a lot of stuff. There we go. That'll do. I'm going to go home and replace the lanterns that I've got in the, the world already with sea lanterns. It might look like trash, but I'm going to try it. So I'll see you guys back at home and then we'll finish this episode out and try and plan what we're going to do next. Ah, made it. Sweet. Let's go home. I want to see Buddy. I haven't seen him for so long. And I didn't actually almost die this time, which is great news. Hello, friends. Oh, geez. Okay, it's dark. It's dark. Why is it dark? I should have slept before I left. You guys okay? They're actually under more protection than they were before because I got rid of all that junk. So, that's only a good thing. Just want to triple check, though. You guys okay? You guys okay down here? They're looking good. They're huddling up, staying warm. I like it. Teamwork. So, we actually got a lot of stuff here. All this prismarine stuff. So we've got our gold too. Let's pop that in there. That's so much gold actually now that I think about it. Now let's go ahead and change these. I don't know if it's going to look good or not. I feel like the glowstone is probably the best match. Uh, there we go. Yes. Okay, that actually looks cool. I like that. Yes. Oh, this looks cool. Yeah, I think I only have three. That looks cool though. I like that. I like that better. It's kind of like a, a tiny little flex to be like, yeah, I stole these from a Sea Guardian temple. But guys, I think I'm going to end today's episode there because I don't want my, vo my voice to die yet again. We did it. We finally got our treasure from the Guardian's temple. And even though it's just gold, there's a lot of it. And I think that's going to come in handy when we need our golden apples. So I also need to know what to do next. We have got two bosses to do. We've got the Ender Dragon and we've also got the Wither. I kind of want to do the Wither first just because they drop the uh the nether star which means we can use it for a beacon so it's useful and it could help me to get rid of all this if i put haste on it so that's an option we now have mending on every piece of our armor we just need to go up to actually we've got protection on everything thorns would be good though and then we need to think of a, a way to kill the wither so i think i'm gonna make some progress on that next time thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed leave a like that'd be greatly appreciated leave a like for me being back yay subscribe if you're brand new so you can keep up with videos every single day and also with this Series, and I'll see you all, all of you, in the next one. Goodbye. Posters, tie swing, wagon, candle, canvas, sofa, fork, rubber band.